Good morning. I'm meteorologist TJ Del Santo with an update on Hurricane Lee. Still a hurricane out there in the Atlantic. Moving northward, northwest of Bermuda. Bermuda had some uh, tropical storm conditions over the last 24 hours. Category 1 storm, 85 miles an hour. It'll continue to work its way northward and passing off to our east over the next 24 hours or so. Uh, perhaps as a Category 1 storm weakening into a tropical storm as it works its way into Atlantic Canada. Let's take a look at it with the hour-by-hour -hour forecast. You can see that we're looking at a lot of clouds throughout the uh, daytime today. It'll be fairly breezy, but we're going to be dry. Late this evening, might find some rain showers across eastern Massachusetts. The hurricane continuing to work its way north. It may wobble a little bit back and forth east and west over the uh, nighttime hours and into tomorrow morning, and we're still looking at the chance for some rain showers and gusty winds late tonight right through the morning and then in the afternoon the sun comes back out and the winds should begin to ease across all of southern New England. So tropical storm warnings in effect for South Coastal, Bristol County, Massachusetts and all of Eastern Mass including Cape Cod and the islands. So what does it mean? Even though Rhode Island's not in a tropical storm warning, we could still be looking at winds 35, 45 miles an hour. Stronger winds across eastern Mass, 50, 55 perhaps over in New Bedford, and even stronger winds across Cape Cod and the islands, 60 to 70 mile an hour gusts possible there. So what does it mean for power outage potential? Slight chance across Rhode Island. Keep in mind, ground's very saturated. The winds could certainly topple some trees, so isolated out outages in Rhode Island. Better chance across eastern Massachusetts where it it will be a little windier and of course we're still tracking some big ocean waves 9 to 12 foot waves crashing on our shorelines for the uh, next several days likely today and actually through the weekend please stay off of rocks and jetties best bet just stay out of the water through the weekend so that's what we're looking at with hurricane lee we'll be talking about it all morning long on 12 news this morning we'll have the latest updates for you as well through the day